So you never believe this if you just didn't see it. I was out here going through my uh, hives out here, and uh, this hive had a, a mated queen that was caged in it, and they released her. I seen her in here. I seen eggs in here, and when I was almost finished going through the hives here, they swarmed out on me. Well, when they started doing all that, I just took some uh, lemongrass oil and put it right by the entrance here and uh, sprayed it on a couple other empty boxes just in case and they came back to here so uh, it looked like the queen was right here where these bees are huddled up but I think she flew back up here and it seems like they're starting to go in now because there was a lot more bees hanging off the front of this thing so um, they still got plenty of room in here I'm not sure what happened but I'll come back and check on them later. Okay, so I'm back at the bee yard. Uh, June 2nd, two days after the swarm on this box right here. They started pouring out. Well, I didn't have time to stay and make sure I caught the queen and all that. So I just left them and let nature do its thing. And, uh, what I did do is I added another box on top there to give them a little more room. Maybe that's what they needed. There was a lot of bees in there. Um, but I introduced a mated queen. So um, we'll see what happens. I'll keep an eye on them. I'll give them a little while to settle in before I go back in. Maybe the queen wasn't... Uh, made it as well as I thought she would but anyway so you never believe this if you just didn't see it but uh, underneath that box I was just talking about um, it pretty much has a queen in it and uh, underneath the bottom of it was a pile of bees so I ended up finding a queen and uh, I was trying to get her out of here and into another cage because some bees were trying to ball her up and uh, she flew out of my hands. Well, I had Swarm Commander in my pocket, so I took the little lid off, set it right here. I've got one bee fanning right here, and she circled back and landed right on my glove. And I clipped her up. But anyway, I still gotta get her in this cage here. Okay, so I didn't have any, uh, any candy or anything to put in this, but I just put some AC filter material. Now I'm going to put her back with these bees. these bees were on the bottom of the, the box but I took this top box off and this bottom box is full of bees and there's a bunch of bees up in the top too so I'm almost positive there's already a queen in here I think this this queen flew out mated came back and landed on the bottom of the box right there but anyway they're fanning calling the, trying to call the rest of the bees down on this box so I'm setting this up as a new home for them. I'm releasing this queen that uh, I had caged here that I found on the bottom of another one of my boxes uh, that had a swarm. So I'm going to go ahead and release her and let her go down in here with, the, with these bees here. She just walked in. Put these bees down with her. The ones that were with her. What I'll do. 
I'm not gonna mess with them anymore. I'm gonna go ahead and shut them down here. And hopefully, she'll be able to build this hive up here.